Welcome to Are You New Here? I'm Chris McConnell on the home base team with eXp Realty. We're out getting to know our neighbors here in Wilmington, Delaware. Today we're downtown at Stitch House Brewery. Let's see what's new here. We're here at Stitch House Brewery. I'm with co-owner Rob Snowberger. Rob, thanks for having us. Yeah, thank you for having for uh, doing the interview. Appreciate it. Well, of course. So, uh, Rob, are you new here? I am not new here. Uh, I am from Wilmington. I grew up here. Uh, and so did my business partner Dan, Dan Sheridan. Um, but Stitch House has been around for four years now on Market Street. And uh, so, while we're not new here, uh, we certainly are uh, newish on the block. And we feel that. We have really embraced the, the downtown revitalization. And as, as neighborhood kids growing up in Wilmington, Dan and I thought that we wanted to do something to bring a little bit of, you know, of ourselves back to Market Street. And so a brewery so, thought like uh, the best thing to do, you know, every community out there that's uh, turning around has their own brewery and their own stamp on it. So we said, hey, let's give it a shot. And we teamed up with Andrew Rutherford, who are, who's our brewer from, originally from Yards Brewery, okay. uh, decided to come down here to Wilmington and bring his talents. And so, uh, so here we are, four years, and we got a great Eagles crowd going, and uh, we're super excited. Yeah, for sure. I, I know you have a, a great selection of beers here. What, what would you say is the best thing about Stitch House Brewery? Excellent. So best thing about the brewery, it's got to be the vibe that's created by the people and uh, the food and the beer combo. And I say the vibe simply because, you know, we got a great brewer, we got great chef, and we really got great people who are committed to you know, making something really special downtown. In fact, I just talked to the staff and said, hey, what would you say is the best thing about this place? And all the answers were different. People were like, oh, you gotta say the burger, or you gotta say the beer. You know, you gotta say, hey, the, the great vibe that we got going on. So I decided to choose on vibe that's created here is, is something really special. When you, you have a motivated staff that wants to treat you well, wants to show you a good time, I think that's the best thing we got going. Yeah, it's a good sign when it's, it's hard to pinpoint the best thing. Yeah, right? <laughs> it's a good thing. A lot of good things going on here. So I know uh, the world's been changing for everybody over the last couple of years. So compared to maybe a year or two ago, what's what's new here now? What's new here now is probably uh, first would be you know with the the COVID restrictions, the the city was really awesome and opened up outside seating for us. So if you come in any time that's reasonable to be outside, we got the the couple parking spots blocked off, and we got you know our our presence is now flowed out into the street. We also got a nice open accordion window, so we got like the inside outside vibe going in the summertime. In the winter time we got a uh, DJ here at the Eagles game so we have a really really good scene for, for Eagles games. It's super fun. Um, and then of course uh, you know we have basically a reopening. You know we, we closed for you know half a year and then open for takeout and then we were doing limited seating. So it's almost like a rebirth when you know when you have to shut down for safety and reopen. So it's kind of like we're having all new all over again. Yeah, for sure. You can you can feel the energy of the, the people here ready to, yeah. to get out there and support yeah. the Eagles for sure. Yeah, it's well, it's just a good crowd. You know, there's there's a lot more people living downtown than there used to be, and we're happy to, to have them as our regulars. Happy to have them as our crowd, and uh, you know, we're just we're glad that people still travel to come visit us, but we're also really glad to have a solid base of folks who now live downtown, and this is their neighborhood, and we're proud to be a part of it. That's great. So, how about going forward? What's what would you say is going to be new on the horizon here? So uh, new on the horizon is that we, uh, as a company, uh, are looking to potentially um, expand the brand, whether it's called Stitch House again or whether it's a different name. Um, you know, we also are expanding the Trolley Square. We have a restaurant that we're going to be opening up in a year. Um, we're looking at some spaces in Old Newcastle. Uh, so now that we have a good footing and a really solid crew, uh, you know, we kind of want to take the good vibes and export it to other areas in the city of Wilmington, but you know, just different neighborhoods. So, uh, so that would be something that's new. But you know, home base is home base. When you when you brew your first beer uh, on the Super Bowl and you call it Big Stitch Nick after Nick Foles, you know, there's there's always a special place in your heart. And so, uh, you know, so it's this. I guess what I would say is new is this will be home base, and then we'll have a few other spots 
uh, to come check out as well. So. That's awesome. Sounds like a lot of great things uh, coming up on the, on the horizon for you guys. And excited to be here. Excited to uh, experience all things Stitch House. So thanks, yeah, Rob. Yeah, absolutely. I appreciate thanks you, a man. lot. Appreciate it. Definitely. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Come see us. Big thanks to Rob and Paige and the whole staff here at Stitch House Brewery. Be sure to check them out at stitchhousebrewery.com and come visit them down here on Market Street in downtown Wilmington. Mention the Are You New Here video and get 15% off your entree. We'll see you next time in Are You New Here.